30 ramps here and you can hear you can hear them um, they, they are um, all um, young rams there's no old ramps they're all about 12 months old um, and i'm just going to show you how to to look at at the ram no normally normally what we want on a ram is this is a very young ram this ram is not even 12 months, maybe it's 10 months. 10 months. Yes. And he, he already shows lots of uh, good, robust potential. He's got lots of loose skin. You can see he's got lots of loose skin, which is a sign he's going to grow. Still a lot. His, his horns is nice and white. It's not not close to it. It's it's wide. So you don't want. If you want, if, if you if you select a ram with a broad head, a broad head is 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 a sign of a a broad body and a, a broad. And if you can breed into your ears, the broader the rump area, the easiest he's gonna give birth. You you mean uh, the big head? It's mean we will have it, it will have a, 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 a big, normally if you look at an animal with a narrow head you see it's gonna maybe this ram it's got a narrow tarayela ถ้าแพ้หัวใหญ่เนี่ยมันก็จะมีอกใหญ่แล้วมันจะมีตูดใหญ่ก็คือเลือกแพ้ให้เลือกหัวก่อนเลยนาว look at this ram you can see it's got a, a flat a flat, very narrow head and look the body เหมือนเหมือนตัวนี้นะครับ it's a very narrow body หัวเล็กนะครับ yeah. And now again, the head already shows you. Look at the head first. Always you look at the head first. This ram hasn't got a good head. This is not a good head. It's got a very flat head. It's got a narrow head. And now again, it's got a narrow body. And it's got a very short ram. Look there. Too short. Now look at this ram. It's got a broad This ram's got a broad head. A nice, strong, robust head. Look at the muscle here, look at the front leg, look at the long ramp, look here. So it's got a very long ramp and it's got a very wide at the back. So if you can breed animals wide at the back, even your ears, you're going to have less problem with animals giving birth. If you also select the ramp, we, we want a nice strong top line, thick front legs and we also look like I told you earlier, on the nipples of the ram. How about the, the ankle of, of the legs? Yes, I'm going to show you now. We also check on the nipples. You, you see, they, they are... You either look for something like this, which is ideal, or like this. Nothing like this, which is joint. Or nothing with maybe like this and it's got mm. a small small uh, so if you select the ram separate uh, uh, separately uh. single uh, uh, teats good teats if they are like this two on this side two on the, good teats but no fish tail no fish mm. where, where they like, like, like you can feel feel the testicles always you can feel there's no abnormal, abnormal uh, uh, abscesses or anything, and like I told you, the split must be small, fi less than five centimeters. Okay, five, five, five centimeters. Okay, here from here, from here to there. Yes. Like this, from there to there, ah. mustn't be more than four. That is okay. Yes, this is under ah. perfect. About two. That's about two centimeters. Ah. Yes, it's perfect. And then we, I'll see if I can get an example to show you. We always want the ram to stand nice on his hoofs, like this. Not, he mustn't stand like that. Mm -hmm. Mustn't stand like this. Mm -hmm. He must stand nice, straight, mm -hmm. straight on the hoof. Mm -hmm. And then, then again, you don't want the ram. I am around you. You don't want the ram. If you look at it here, to be too straight. He, he mustn't be. He mustn't. He, he, you, you must still uh, see that. Uh, 
he mustn't be too too straight on on. Like this is good and go. This is good, yes. Mm. Just doesn't stand nice now. Mm. They, they is almost too straight. Mm. Now the way he's standing now, Lisa is a pillow. Mm. But when he stands normal, because he was holding him. Okay. You see, if he stands normal, mm. it's very nice. Mm. Mm. It's not helping. He got uh, some uh, No, no, no. So just anyone I was catching. No, it's just a, ra a random ram. And then again, you must always look on the rams, the teeth mm. of the ram. This, this will probably still be a lamb. Mm -hmm. Yes, all milk teeth. So he's, 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 this ram is around about 10, 11 months uh, old. So it's all milk teeth. He's got no permanent teeth. This is all milk teeth. Um, and his bite is perfect. Can you see that he, uh -huh. it mustn't be, there mustn't be a gap like this. Uh -huh. on, on big rams, which are full mouth, eight, uh -huh. eight tooth rams, uh -huh. we, we allowed about eight millimeters. Uh -huh. But this ram is perfect. The bite is nice mm -hmm. and it's still very nice and young. We checked, he's got good teeth, mm -hmm. good testicles, mm -hmm. very nice broad head, mm -hmm. broad horn placement, mm -hmm. strong in the hind quarter mm -hmm. and lots of loose, loose skin. Mm -hmm. It's a robust ram, he's gonna yeah. still grow a lot. Mm -hmm. What is the weight? The weight. I would say maybe 100, 110. <laughs> and his father was Lister. And the mother was 1606. Uh, what about uh, Yes. The horns, if you look from the side, you want the, the head and the horns to, to form. You, you don't want the head to go like this and then the horns like this. Mm. You don't want the head to be round like this and the horns like this. Mm. So you want a smooth mm. curl. Mm. It, it must, it must, it must mm. fit to the head as well. You don't want it to go up, you don't want it to go too wide. Mm. So you, you want a ram like this, the horns must... must Full a nice line. It must be a very nice mm. okay, line if you look from the side. Like that one. Mm. Yes, this one is not good. Mm. Yeah. To show you, can you yeah. see the head and the horns? Yeah. Don't look. There's not a good line. This one is not smooth. It's going to get smooth. It's going to get and you can hear the noise of the rams, they are very fertile. Um, uh, normally when you get to somebody, you look at the rams and you don't hear the noise. Um, it's, this is for me, when I go to buy rams from somebody, it's a good sign to hear the rams. You can hear they are active, they are, they are, they are, they are horny, they, they are very, very active. And another good sign is also the, the front legs. Can you see the front legs is very yellow. So it means this ram sperm a lot on, him, on himself. So this color here is, is only of the sperm. It, 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 it's a sign that this ram are fertile. Yellow color? Yes. This, this, the color here. It's, you, you can also smell it. It's sperm. So it, yeah, it's sperm. So, yeah. This color come from sperm, right? Yes, yes, uh, not, not color of... No, 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 no. no. It's not the color of the animal. If, if I take water, I wash it, it's going to be white. That one is not as good, but this one you can see is a very fertile ram. This one is
It's a good, good sign of, of a fertile mm. ram. If you must buy a ram from someone and you don't have a veterinarian there to test or to check, then you must decide. Then that's a good sign to check. Mm. เนี่ยเป็นสัญญาณเป็นสัญญาณว่าเออตัวเนี้ยเนี่ยก็คือลอยลอยน้ําเชื้อเนี่ยมันจะฉีดมาโดนเนี่ยไอ้ตัวไห